Welcome to your Unstoa break time. Today we're going to talk about the new upgrade to Primavera Unifier 15.2 with its improved email approval and mobile access functions. Let's go take a look. By now most of you should have upgraded to 15.2 but if you're still on 10 or even 9 here's a couple of great reasons for you to go ahead and upgrade. Now with email approval we have form and formula calculation validation. But what does that really mean? It's first part three of the day. Your colleague's on the green and one. He never does that. It's a weekday afternoon on the course, so it's probably okay to get your phone out and quickly check your email while you're waiting. If you're going through your inbox, you suddenly realize that PO is there. The one you've been talking about in the project management meetings every week. You have a look through it, but you're confident. You've got a great team behind you. They've crossed all the T's, dotted all the I's. So you do a quick sense check of that attached PDF. It's all looking good. Hit approve. Hit send on the email. You're done. Now in the past, you'd be walking to the next T, listening to your colleague tell you why he needs to get a new putter. But in the back of the mind, you'll be thinking, did that PO really make it to Ed and Grace in procurement? There could be an issue with a validation check on the form or a problem with a calculation somewhere. Even if somebody in your group has approved that record before you, all of this results in that record not being processed properly. In 15.2, you get a notification just like this if you have any issue with your record approval. So as you take your next shot, you're not thinking about adding grace in procurement. With this new feature, you're not just done, you're done done. Mobile access in 15.2. Now you can do everything you'd expect you'd be able to do from a mobile version of Unifier. Drill in and out of projects, review your tasks and action them. Even if you're in a pinch, create a record. Far more useful though is adding attachments, specifically photos you've just taken on your device. But look, this isn't going to replace your laptop or your desktop access yet. The apps are coming in version 16 for that, right? This is just a really nice way to access your project, reference something, get a little task done when you're out and about and you're not sat at your desk. Don't forget to follow us on LinkedIn, Twitter, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching, but now get back to work because break time's over.